Rugby takes center stage this weekend in L.A. Dignity Health Sports Park will host the sport when the Olympics come here in 2028. But this weekend, it's all about the Los Angeles Sevens. And there's plenty on the line, including qualification points for the 2024 Olympics. But as I learned, rain or shine, it's also a party for fans all over the globe. On time, in extra time, in L.A. LA 7s has been here before, but it's even bigger and better. Yeah, it is. Uh, we're super excited about having it. We've got 16 international teams from all over the world coming in to play this weekend. It's more than the sport, but the sport in itself with the captains turning up and the palm trees and the sun, hopefully it cross fingers uh, uh, keeps that way, then we're going to have an awesome weekend. It's a snapshot of, of what to expect in 2028, but there's so much more than rugby going on this week. We have an international fan festival, you know, so we have food and drink and music. You've never really experienced, you know, 2,000 Fijians and, you know, 1,000 Kenyans and a bunch of South Africans and a bunch of USA people all mixing together, unless you've been to the Olympic Games. So we really try to combine kind of that Mardi Gras, you know, and that sport dynamic into one. I'm extremely excited, you know, I get to have my wife, kids, my family come out, everybody's family's coming out from all over the country. Country, and we finally get to play on home soil, so we're, we're ready to go with Juice. The U.S. has three cup wins, and two of them are on home soil, so we, we play big when it comes here. Last time the crowd was outstanding. It was one of the loudest crowds I've heard in a while, so I look forward to seeing that again, and I know there's a lot of uh, Samoan support here, and obviously we're playing Samoa and USA in our pool, so I think we're into, in for some good hard games and a lot of noise from the crowd. So tell us what's at stake this weekend. We have qualifying points for the Olympics in 2024. We're kind of at the midway point of, of the series. We're right? exactly right in the midway point, so it's all almost like moving day in golf. The season is at stake for us. You know, we're we're about three points behind third place, top four qualify. So this, this weekend is a real big weekend for us as far as staying in contention for qualifying for the Olympics. For someone who has never seen the sport or doesn't know much about the sport, what would be your pitch to come out this weekend? Well, the funny thing is we all know the sport. We played in our backyard growing up. And you take the ball, you take the ball. It's really a combination of soccer, and basketball, and lacrosse, and football all mixed in together. Anybody who loves sports, anybody who loves to party, anybody just looking for a good time, Rugby seven is the place to be for it. It's probably the, the best sport you've either never seen or never experienced. And once you do, I don't think you'll ever go back. Well, I'm going to go. I, I was sold when I was at the, the captain's photo uh, yesterday. And uh, if you're there, say what's up. It's much more than a game. It's an event, a festival, 16 different nations.